Hello, I want to talk something about the new function of VM login, which is a browser automation testing tool. First of all, we open the official website and click on the tutorial document. Here are some software instructions and the tutorials. Let's find the VM login browser automated testing tool. This document is about the method and the explanation of this software, as well as the download link. Copy this link to download and install it. At present, it is limited to Windows system. I've already downloaded it in advance. Let's show you how to deal with it. First, Open the browser automation tool and our background. Click the login token to generate a token in the background. Click on the token generated API in the background to generate a token randomly. Today, we mainly demonstrate the function of VM login automatic setting, which can be operated perfectly without any technology. First of all, we log in to the client, my account, open and enable browser automation settings, set the listening port and the listening address, and save it. The listening port can be modified as you wish. We fill in the set address and port here. After fill in, click test, which will show the port is normally open. Next, we add the specified configuration ID, which needs to be viewed in the browser configuration file of the client. I've already set the configuration file in advance, so just right-click to edit the configuration file. There is an ID at the bottom. We can fill it in right after you copy it. If you add multiple IDs, you need to separate them with the sign. Let's test to Google first. Click Add Action, select the auction type to open the URL and copy the Google URL, click OK. Add a full suite. This display here is Mrs. Filling 2000, which is 2 seconds. Select this option. Let's use Google to demonstrate it. After opening Google, press Fn plus F12. Then click here. On the right side, you can see the name equal Q, type equal text. Click Add Action, select Send Key, and enter a word you want to search for. Confirm. Select Forced Width, 2 seconds. Here is the same as the above method. Click here and put the mouse on Google Search. On the right, you can see what name and type are equal to. Then go back to the document, copy the line, modify it, and click OK.
Select and click. It can be empty here. Then select for switch and confirm. The setting is completed here. The click start automated testing. You can see the effect. Since I have set two browser profile IDS, the first one here will close automatically right after this call operation. And then the second will continue to start. Well, some people maybe wonder, what happened if I can't open one of these? Will it be continue? Yes, of course, that's for sure. Please don't worry about it. After skipping, it will continue. Some other people maybe wonder, can I open multiple web page on one browser? Yes, that's for sure. Let's give you a demonstrate right now. Let's try Yahoo. Still follow the previous process. Add web pages. For switch. Control ID. Send key. For switch. Control ID. Click for switch. The only difference is that Yahoo has a control ID. Click to start automated test. First Google, then Yahoo. After the first browser profile website is completed, the second will automatically start the same operation process. Our settings can be also be exported or imported. First, create a document, then click Export Action, paste directly. And then save. You can also directly modify it to import. Right click copy and click import to directly import. You can also click diamond to see the example. Well, I guess that's it. If you guys want to try more about it,
Maybe you need to start from simple basic process and then add some extra complex requirements. Thank you all.